only what they did before the other one. You're pretty good at this one. Okay. I've had, um, I used to say, lots of experience. Uh, are you sure we're pressurized? Mm hmm. Mm. Why? Because it's getting warm in here. Very warm. Approaching hot. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know why? Why? It is because we are flying so close to the sun. Oh, that is. 30,000 feet and climbing. And climbing. And climbing. Mm. I knew this was going to be a fantastic trip. Hmm? To the coast in record time. <laughs> Not quite there yet, Bobby. Why do I get the impression that you are not a girl that plays by the rules? And I think you are very perceptive. Uh huh. Mm. Mm. Again? Oh, why not? It is customary at our age. Huh? <laughs> no, we can't. Oh no. Mm, we're almost there. How do you know? Look out the window. I see a town. Mm, not a town, my dear. The town. Ah. Mm. So soon? Mm hmm. Oh. In record time. You see that over there? That beautiful house? That's my daddy's. No. Yes. What do you <sighs> say we buzz it? No, you mean as in. Mm -hmm. 500 feet? Come on. <sighs> Let's knock the Renoirs off its walls. Ah. I knew there was a reason you brought me along. Well, you couldn't think it was because I needed help flying. <laughs> <laughs> that is why one usually hires a pilot. You know how to use that thing? Oh, gee, you know, I need to think about it. I mean, do I, do I pull the ripcord and count to three, or count to three and pull the ripcord? All right, I was just checking. Yeah. Oh, slow it down and circle around the house. Ah, uh, and then what? Then I bail out. This is goodbye? I'm afraid so. Ah, oh, that's life. I can deal with that. Well, anyway, thanks for your help. Anytime. <laughs> well, there is your father's house. He must be quite a man, your father, for you to go to such trouble. Oh, he's the kind of man most women only get to dream about. My name is Jean. Oh, right, Jean. Unlatch the door, Jean. This woman's got an appointment with destiny. <laughs> ah! I thought it was only a birthday party, huh? <laughs> In. I think I just did. Look, I'm sorry about the crushed flowers. Uh, don't worry, send me a packet of flower seeds. Yeah, I will. Warren Lockridge, huh? Yeah, right. Oh, hey, wait a minute. I know who you are. You're Eden Capwell. Am I? Yeah, I think. Oh! <clears throat> You're the cupcake who belongs to that dude in England, the uh, Earl of Pearl. Be careful. Where did you read that, huh? Santa Barbara Inquirer? Yeah, right. Oh, my God. I love gossip. So, uh... Imagine having Eden Capwell in my own front lawn. Yeah, well, how lucky can you get, huh? <laughs> hey, this is a treat. But what brings you back to, uh, to Santa Barbara? I thought you were off in England, showing old Mary England a good old time. Yeah, well, it's too many egg sandwiches or watercress sandwiches at high tea. Well, how about let me take you out for a good old American hamburger? Uh, actually, no. You know, I have to get to Daddy's party, otherwise uh, there isn't going to be a party. Hey, well, you don't strike me as the kind of girl that lets a daddy tell her what to do. Well, I'll tell you something. <clears throat> Why don't we psychoanalyze me another time? 
because you will get out of my way. I would very gladly like to go on my way. Well, what's the matter, Miss Capwell? You think I'm too good for you? Ashley Warren, I don't think about you at all. Bye. Well, I'll send you a bill for the flowers.